Hi, we're back with another first impressions video of the new RCM books. Uh, so today I'm looking at RCM Prep B, and I'm looking forward to this piece. It just sounds cool. Uh, it's by Dennis Alexander, and it's called A Gorilla Named Chi. Uh, and there's lyrics. So I have a friend, a big gorilla, happy as can be. And if you ask him, what's your name, he'll gladly say, I'm Chi. He's big and strong and mostly fearless. This is very true. But if Chi sees two mice or three, he'll scream and cry and run right back to me. I love my Chi. <laughs> it sounds absolutely adorable. Uh, for those who aren't familiar with Dennis, uh, Dennis is a composer and a pedagogue down in the States. He, he's written and co-written uh, several method books. Uh, he is, you can check him out on um, Alfred. I'm also working through his uh, nocturnes, so uh, check those videos out. Okay, let's check out a gorilla named Chi. Ooh, it's down here, of course, because it's down low. Okay. Mm. I was like, I'm just looking it over before I try sight reading, so I'm gonna go here and down, lowest group of three black beans and squares. Oh good. <laughs> Thanks for making it easy. I don't have to think too hard there. Okay. All right, let's go. Nice and slow. It says ponderously, so I will go extra ponderously since I'm sight reading. so easy to picture this gorilla named Chi wrinkling wrinkling his nose um, okay so G minor uh, ponderously so that's uh, think slow Th think about how a gorilla kind of like moseys along you know not not when they're angry you know. this would be good to to work on you know arm weight and uh, it wouldn't hurt to watch a few videos to see how gorillas move and how they use your ar their arms. So you can work that in uh, when learning it. Uh, this also really works students' ability, their coordination to go up and down the different registers. So that kind of makes me think of, uh, I, I know it's more chimpanzees and monkeys that will swing on trees, but I mean, gorillas can do that to a degree, a little bit, but I mean. They use their arms a lot. I'm just trying to think. Uh, I haven't seen any videos lately where they're like swinging on trees, but they do use their arms and grab things. So that's kind of what I'm thinking of as the hands are moving back and forth. Yeah, what a really cool piece. <laughs> awesome, Dennis. Love it. I cannot wait to explore this with a student in the coming year or coming years. The dynamics really are, I mean, when it drops down to that pianissimo, 
to indicate or to, to yeah. a little bit of word painting there for the, the two or three mice. Um, and actually, it's really cool because he's got like two mice here and then three mice here. So really awesome word painting. That's, that's something really cool to explore with students as well. Uh, yeah, if you're working on this song, let me know what you think about it. Uh, if you, you've taught the piece before, share your thoughts on it. And yeah, catch you in the next video. Thanks for stopping by. Bye.